up you guys and welcome to today's video. Today's video is going to be a little bit different for you guys but I'm really excited to bring this to you. We're actually doing a review of a new climbing documentary that just came out. I was super psyched to get reached out to by one of the producers of the documentary itself. He gave us the opportunity to watch it so we actually watched it last night with my brother and Jen, his wife. Um, I'm like super pumped to go climbing tonight. Uh, basically the, the video itself is following a few of the pro climbers in the community as they travel the world, which is the goal. Travel the world in search of new climbs, of new boulders to climb. It's experiencing a whole new level of adventure and it's something that Matt and I have barely even begun to scratch the surface of in our own lives. Watching this, I was just blown away by some of the scenery and the climbs, the locations that they go to for these climbs. Like, it's crazy. He actually did give me a link for you guys to check out the documentary below. If you do want to watch it, I highly recommend it. Even if you're not a climber yourself, it's just very, very eye-opening to see this whole other level of fitness and performance. It's amazing watching some of the things that these guys do and you don't have to be a climber to appreciate it. It's about an hour long, really, really cool documentary. They seem like really down to earth guys. It's just awesome, just awesome. So me and Matt are gonna get to talking a little bit more about this actual documentary. So I will see you guys in the next clip and then we're gonna go climbing tonight. So yeah, let's go. showed a little too much skin there. <laughs> I think it was good. Uh, what I like about uh, climbing videos is there's there's a whole experience around it. You basically go on a trip with them. You know, they talk about the travels. They film little portions of their day feeling that culture. With this video, it's more documentary kind of style. What's really neat about it is it talks about like what you could be or you know what you could do instead of you know being one of the followers. The concept of just standing somewhere that no one has stood before, being somewhere that no one has been before. And that's kind of held true since I was really young. The closest I can get to that is this never ending hunt for the perfect line. You know, it's like there is still so much more out there and finding something extraordinary that isn't easy to get to, that hasn't been traveled before. And it's, you know, it's taking that, that road less traveled. So most videos are created to get someone to go somewhere and then want to basically follow in someone's steps. This one is almost telling you, like almost recruiting better climbers to go find new lines. And it's just really neat. Soundtrack. Soundtrack was Music good. Music was really good. There yeah. are a lot of good songs on there. And the video quality was really neat. Uh, the failed drone footage at the end was funny. That was good. <laughs> Those, what I get from, from these type of videos and these type of films is it makes me want to do more with my life. <laughs> I don't even come at it from the aspect of a pure climber because I'm not that great of a climber myself, but it inspires me to get out more and to experience the world more. And they showed a little bit of footage of some of the locals and just get out and, and enjoy the world rather than stick to our little screens. As you guys are watching this, it was really cool to see them go to these different places and, and I had no idea there was climbing in Zimbabwe. Um, at one point in the film, they showed um, this huge field of just boulders, like as far as the eye can see. And it just looked like something out of like a storybook. It was just absolutely gorgeous. It would be amazing to be able to go there and not even just to climb, just to hang out. <laughs> just to see it and experience it firsthand. These types of films, I, I would encourage anybody to, to check it out because it inspires you to just see the world. To experience the world in new ways that you haven't before. Chris Sharma, um, there was one quote in there that he talked about uh, how bouldering is kind of like an art form. When you finally climb them, 
it's so satisfying. It's like this interactive sculpture or something that, of course, the rock has already been there, but uh, we're bringing this, you know, human interaction to it, and it becomes much more than just a random boulder. It becomes this work of art. It's, it's just life. I've never really thought about it that way. It's really, really cool to be able to, to kind of connect with your environment in that way. It just, it makes me want to be a better climber <laughs> and go on more adventures. They showed a V3 or V5. It was a V5. They showed that really awesome V5. V5. Hey, you can still climb, you can probably climb a V5. But it, it kind of, it just, I don't know if you guys have seen the movie Into the Wild. All of these climbing documentaries and climbing videos kind of remind me of, of that. The first time that I watched Into the Wild, it made me want to just sell all of my things and travel. We're doing um, that. <laughs> we plan to do that and very here soon. We are. In a couple years, you guys will see us in some type of documentary about people living the nomad life. <laughs> I'd love to do a video like they just did, something like that. But. Yeah, I mean, I, w I want to film the whole year. Whether you're a climber or not, I think it'd be a really cool thing to watch. Just to see a whole different aspect of fitness. Like, the things that these guys do is just mind-blowing. You see them hanging on to something, but to the naked eye, there's nothing there. Like, how the heck is he mm -hmm. holding on to this rock that there's nothing there? Like, it's it's insane. They show some of the coolest routes in this video, too. Mm -hmm. The things that you, like, aspire to be able to do just... I just want to be able to hold this. Only in your wildest dreams. Yeah. Wonder what it would be like to be that good. Yeah, ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, it was it was really really enjoyable. You guys can go over there and purchase it just straight from the link. But definitely recommend if you need some motivation to do more with your life <laughs> and to experience the world more and in a different way. It's a really cool motivate me to climb. Yeah, that's the thing. It really motivates you to climb. Like that whole thing, it's like I was having trouble gripping onto like my drinks and things like that, you know? My hands it's are just, sweaty. Oh. <laughs> just dropping your fork as you're watching. Yeah. And I mean, if you're not a climber, it might motivate you to climb too. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe somebody that watches it gets into climbing and ends up traveling. Hey, we started somewhere too. I'm still starting. Yeah. Well, now that we're motivated to climb, you want to go to the Rock Gym? Mm-hmm. Let's do it.